Brian and style. Yeah, thanks. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. So I'm Erica from Kensington Vanguard. And I'm Kate Elliott from the Kate Elliott team at Caldwell Banker. We are here to talk about how I like to work with builders. And we have a lot of homes in this area that are getting restored. And so we actually, as a service to our builders, work with them to help select design choices. So I, we should go in and take a look. It's half done. So be a little bit careful, but there's some exciting design decisions to be made. Perfect, let's take a look. All right. Hey, Dave. Hey, what's up? How are you? Good to see you. How's it going? Hi, how are you? <laughs> Good, Erica, this is Dave Kasdan from Kasdan Construction Management and Kasdan Homes. Very nice to meet you. And he is our builder for this property here at 393 Irving in South Orange. Should we start with the bathroom? Definitely. Sure, so this is a bathroom? Well, this was a bathroom, and now it's gonna be a bathroom and a laundry room. Okay, so Dave, tell me, why does it make sense to get Kate involved so early on in a project like this when the bathroom is literally down to the studs? She really helps me kind of push outside the box on ideas and design, and we really just have a lot of fun with the project. Dave has really good taste, but the fact of the matter is, you know, as buyers come through and they're seeing more and more of the same thing, mm -hmm. we take a little bit of risk. This is how Dave gets the most money for his homes is because he's pushing the envelope a little bit. Wow, you guys really like a lot of color and taking a lot of risks with this design. Uh, where do you see our accent wall? There's an accent wall? Yeah, let's go. Let's look. This is sort of the focal point of when you walk in the house, right? Okay. And so we really wanted to do something fun. So we worked with a muralist. So this is custom. No other house is gonna have this in the United States. Absolutely right. Right, it hits you as soon as you walk in. I couldn't have imagined a better a piece of wall art. I love it. Cool. Guys, I have a really good idea. All right, so you know how we were talking about open concept? I was thinking it might be a great idea to open up this wall from the dining room into the second family room. Are you cool with this? <laughs> Let's go for it. All right, E, crowbar, ready? Ready. Let's break it down. I'm actually gonna leave Dave to finish the rest of this particular project, but E, do you wanna go see a house that's already finished? Let's go see it. All right. <laughs> All right, welcome to 99 Myrtle Avenue in the historic Wyoming district of Milburn, New Jersey. I love the ceilings. Yeah, so those are all custom. Everything from this part of the house forward is new build, and the rest of the part is actually restored. There's so much detail. Tell me about this kitchen. I know this, about this countertop. This kitchen is amazing. This has that same open concept that it seems that the builder in the first project is trying to achieve. This builder has also right. been able to achieve it. And I didn't even have to knock over any walls myself. This is all new oak flooring throughout the entire house. They paid a lot of attention to open concept and flow. You have the formal sit down dining room and the living space here. I love everything about this house. I love seeing the finished product. I can't wait to see how that first builder's project turns out. Well, you can, so stay tuned for our next episode of The American Dream New Jersey. Bye.